Hey there everyone, welcome back to a brand new episode of Let's Play Undertale. Oh, let me uh, put that there. So, as I was saying, welcome back to a brand new episode of Let's Play Undertale. So, as you can tell by my voice, I am a little under the weather. <clears throat> I have this really nasty, itchy throat today. Not much I can do about it, but c'est la vie. Let's go through here. There we go. No more snow effects, so I can actually see. Last time we went on the date with Papyrus, he took us to the Bone Zone. And, uh, yeah. A few things happened there. Hello, Senzi. Yo! Are you sneaking out of here to see her? Wait, are you sneaking out to see her too? Awesome. She's the coolest, right? I want to be just like her when I grow up. Hey, don't tell my parents I'm here. <laughs> This is an echo flower. It repeats the last thing it heard over and over. This is an echo flower. It repeats the last thing it heard over and over. Yep. That's an echo flower. Alright, so because I'm sick, I won't be able to do any of the higher pitch voices. I'll be able to do the deeper ones, no problem, actually. Alright, let's see there. What? Have you seen a guy with two jobs before? Fortunately, two jobs means twice as many legally required breaks. I'm going to Groby's. You wanna come? Yeah, sure. Well, if you insist, I'll prime myself away from work. Uh, tense, by the way. Over here, I know a shortcut. What the magic? Fast shortcut, huh? Hey. Oh, wait. Yeah. Hey, everyone. Hey, Sans. Hi, Sans. Reading signs. Hiya, Sansy. Hey, Sans. Why you just here for breakfast a few minutes ago? Nah, I haven't been to breakfast in at least half an hour. You must be thinking of brunch. Oh, my lord. Here, get comfy. God damn. Whoops, watch me sit down. Sometimes widows put whoopee cushions in the seats. Anyway, let's order. What do you want? Craving a burger. Hey, that sounds pretty good. Probably, we'll have a double order of burg. A burger sounds banging right about now. So, what, what do you think of my brother? Eh, he's pretty cool. Of course he's cool. He'd be cool too if you wore that outfit every day. He only, had, he only takes that thing off if he absolutely needs to. Oh well, at least he washes it. And by that I mean he wears it in the shower. Not really washing it, is it? Here comes the girl. Want some ketchup? Nah, since I'm good. More for me. Don't drink like this vodka. Scratch his ass. Anyway, will it not? I have to agree, Papyrus tries real hard. I thought he keeps trying to be part of the Royal Guard. One day, he went to the house of the Royal Guard. Excuse me, the head of the Royal Guard, and begged her to be to let him be in it. He can't read it either. Of course, she shut the door on him because it was midnight. But the next day, she woke up and saw him waiting there. Seeing his dedication, she decided to give him warrior training. It's uh still a work in progress. Oh yeah, I wanted to ask you something. flower yeah do you know all about it the echo flower i love how talking flower and echo flower were in two different colors they're all over the marsh say something to them and they'll repeat it over and over what about it well papyrus told me something interesting the other day sometimes when no one is around a flower appears and whispers things to him Flattery, advice, encouragement, predictions. Weird, huh? Someone must be using the echo flowers to play a trick on me. Keep an eye out, okay? Thanks. Well, that was a long break. I can't believe I let you pull me away from work that long. Oh, by the way, the flat broke. Can you foot the bill? 
Just 10,000 G. Yeah, sure. Just kidding. Roby, put it on my tab. Sans, do you ever pay your tab? By the way, I was gonna say something, but I forgot. Can, can I take a burger? Uh, I, I would like a burger. Okay, I guess not. Capital's getting pretty crowded, so I've heard they're going to start moving here. Hmm. I don't want to see the, the, the erasure of our local culture, but I definitely want to see some city slippers slip onto their butts. Alright, horsemen. Oh, man. It threw me all the way back here. Alright, well. I'm gonna just enjoy the walk that way. But, yeah, so. Here's the thing. One. Don't think I forgot about, uh. Whatchamacallit? Don't think I forgot about, um. Disgaea. Still gonna do that. It's gonna take me a lot longer than I thought. I finally found a more efficient method of farming for some of the stuff to get to post game. Thank you, Sans, for dropping me off way over there. This is a box. Oh, yeah, it's the same box from before. A box hater. Huh. I remember correctly, these things can push you off. So you can walk this way. Or. You'd be awesome. One, two. One, two. One, two. There you go. Yes, there it is. It's a camera behind the waterfall. Being watched, boys. Uh, nope. Yeah. One, two. One, two. Nope. Split. Aha. Secret door. There's a tutu on the ground. Will you take it? Yes, I will take the old tutu. Oh, uh, let me equip this. And the old tutu. Alright, so each of these items actually does give you different effects at the same time, by the way. So, don't think I'm just equipping stuff for no good reason. Different weapons cause you to do different things. Uh, ooh. I'm going to do my best to be prepared as always. <laughs> Hi, Undyne. I'm here with my daily report uh, regarding that human I called you about earlier. Huh? Did I fight them? D yes, of course I did. I fought them valiantly. What? Did I capture them? Uh, well, no. I tried very hard, Undyne, but in the end, I failed. But what? You're going to take the human soul yourself. But Undyne, you don't have to destroy them. You see... You see... I understand. I'll help you in any way I can. Alright. Betrayal. That's creepy. Oh, sweet mercy. E yo. Wait, no, hold on. I give you a lower voice. Yo, did you see the way she was staring at you? That was awesome. I'm so jealous. What did you do to get her attention? <laughs> Come on, let's go watch her beat some up some bad guys. Good job, kid. A feeling of dread hangs over you, but you stay determined. I think my sick voice would be a great voice for Asgore, not gonna lie. When four bird sheets align in the water, they will sprout. Okay. I don't know that. Aha! I can just pick you up and throw you there. Wee. Wee. And wee. There we go. Nothing about the crack, okay. Bim bamboozled. Aaron flexes in. Flex with him. He flexes twice as hard. Attacks increases for you. 
Flexing contest? Okay. Flex more. Oh, 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 it's sweat. Oh, no. No, no, no. No, no, no. Okay. And he's ready for your next flex. He flex harder. He flexes thrice as hard. Nice. I don't want to lose that. Hey, hey, hey. Keep them sweaty biceps to yourself, my dude. Ow. Dick. He flex. Aaron flexes very hard. He flexes himself out of the room. Huh. <laughs> I'm gonna just flex myself out of the room, boys. I like this. This is cute. I would like mushrooms that turned on and off like that. Okay, let's throw you there. Throw you there. Oh, wait. I did this wrong. Yup. I hit the bridge. Okay. When error is made, the bell blossom can call the bridge sheets back to where they started. Forcing these stupid flowers have to be in a straight line, or else they won't actually become full of flowers. You gotta be a little creativo where you throw the flower rose. Hello, this is Virus. How did I get this number? It was easy. I just dialed every number sequentially until I got yours. <laughs> so, what are you wearing? I'm asking for a friend. She thought she saw you wearing a dusty tutu. Is that true? Are you wearing a dusty tutu? What will you say? Yes. So you are wearing a dusty tutu. Got it. Wink, wink. Have a nice day. But yeah, so I can't really do the higher pitch voices right now. The wishing room. So I'm going to just do some voice editing magic. And then that'll be that. A long time ago, monsters would whisper their wishes to the stars in the sky. If you hoped with all your heart, your wish would come true. Now, all we have are these sparkling stones in the ceiling. Thousands of people wishing together can't be wrong. The king will prove that. Fudge. It's a Washua. You ask Washua to clean you. He hops around excitedly. Green means clean. Sweet. Supposed to be a rubber ducky. Ow. I'm gonna say that's clean. Thanks, Washua. Bye. Come on, sis. Make a wish. I wish my sister and I will get to see the real stars someday. Aw, oh, damn. Ah, seems my horoscope is the same as last week's. Oh yeah, because your horoscope never changes. Look through the telescope. Sure. Check wall. Check wall north, I guess. Oh. Boom, boom, boom. Ancient writing covers the wall. You can just make out the words. The War of Humans and Monsters Why did the humans attack? Indeed, it seemed that they had nothing to fear. Humans are unbelievably strong. It would take the soul of nearly every monster just to equal the power of one human soul. But humans have one weakness. Ironically, it is the strength of their soul. Its power allows it to persist outside of the human body even after death. When a monster defeats a human, they can just take its soul. A monster with a human soul. A horrible beast with unfathomable power. An illustration of a strange creature. There's something very unsettling about this drawing. But yeah, as I was saying earlier, I st still am setting up for the Disgaea stuff right now. Oh great, that thing went backwards. I can't go back that way. But yeah, so I'm setting up for Disgaea 5's basically the finale, quote unquote. I gotta fight uh, Tyrant Overlord Ball and his Carnage counterpart. But the thing that I found out that I can do is, rather than trying to get them to get 10 million stats through having all of the, um, all of the, Jesus, what are they called? All of the classes mastered, 
what I'm going to do is get 10 million stats through getting the uh, magic extracts and magic shards. So it shouldn't take me too long to get. I'm probably going to get about 15 or 20 classes that have that. Usually the classes with the best supports and stuff like that. So I'll get those guys set up so that, that way I can actually have a full squad of 20 to fight Tyrant Overlord Ball. And of course Carnage Tyrant Overlord Ball. But that's going to take some setup time. I'm still setting up for just capturing 99 Asagis on the Asagi map for the Magic Extracts. If I do that I can get like half a mil stats every time I capture 99. So doing about doing that about 20 times per character times 20 characters I have to do it like 400 times but doesn't matter you know I get 20 characters at max stats at 10,000 or 10 million base stats for the first one and then after that I can do hey you know getting you with uh 10 million more base stats by actually finishing out your classes to master those things if I choose to do so or I could just leave you at 10 million and then you know and just give you good items and push you up to like the 30 mil range but at least then i'll have decent characters but the other issue is getting the tyrant or the uh carnage version of the, all their weapons it's going to take me some time because i still need to get the rank 41s of their weapons so it, it or the not 41 the rank 39s of their weapons for the carnage variants so it, it is going to take some time but i digress i kind of went way off on a tangent oh jesus spear Move it! Dodge! Dodge! Oh no! Oh god! Oh lordy! Definitely can't dodge those! Ah, ah, ow! Stop! It's not fair! It's not fair! Ba ba bum! Don't lose hope! A two! Stay determined! That is some. Um, Bull. Bull honky. We're gonna do that again. That was unfair and uncalled for. Alright, so I'm, I gotta backstep. I'm gonna run forward in a moment. Dutch. 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 No, that one should be hit me. honky. That was that. And that one. And that one too. I saw that spear. I think you were messing with me again. God, she's in here. Let me out. Let me out. Grab me. Okay, she grabbed Monster Kid. I love how he's just smiling. She just plops him back down. Like, God damn it, Monster Kid. All right, we're good. In the clear. Yo, did you see that? Undyne just touched me. I'm never washing my face again. Man, you are unlucky. You were standing just a little bit to the left. Yo, don't worry. I'm sure we'll see her again. Good face plant. I do not want to see her again. I'm good. I'm good, my guy. This cheese has been here so long, a magical crystal crystal has grown around it. It's stuck to the table. Weak. 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 Knowing the mouse might one day extract the cheese from the magical crystal, it fills you with determination. Ow. That hurt. A lot. You know what? I'm gonna call the episode here for now, guys. We got to meet uh, a brand new knight character. 
There's also talks of, uh, you know, the, the whole war between humans and monsters and why they're down here and all this other stuff. But monsters don't seem as bad as, you know, everything seems. So, other than that, guys, I will catch you all here next time on Let's Play Undertale. <laughs> mm, excuse me. We'll catch you all here next time on Let's Play Undertale. If you liked today's episode, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Share this video with your friends if you think they might enjoy it or anything else under my content. I'm probably going to get back into playing uh, Apex Legends because I know there's an event going on right now. I might attempt to record that. And I might slide that in on a different slot for like a different day. Just because, you know, Apex Legends is fun. But I'll slide that in on a day where it's like, hey, I can actually slide this in without it having to worry about other Let's Plays not getting done on time. Other than that, guys, we'll catch you all here next time on Let's Play Undertale. If you liked today's episode, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, leave a comment down below, hit that subscribe button with that little notification bell if you aren't already subscribed. Other than that, guys, I will catch you all here next time. Hopefully, I won't be sick by next week. But I hope you all have a great and wonderful day.